Remember when they hate me? Didn't think we made it? Not everything they used to look at me. Remember when I called you? And you didn't fall through. Now you in your face. What's good with y'all? Aight! So, what are we getting into today? Well, it's hella weird. Without the V in here, this garage hella echoes. The V makes for better acoustics in the garage. But yeah, anywho, if you guys seen the last video, you guys know that the CTSV front bumper got hella boofed. Ended up going to uh, pick up a new bumper. Then I had my guy Fats throw all the carbon fiber stuff on there, you know what I'm saying? So the V has a slightly new look, definitely looks more modern, looks, definitely looks better now. You know what I'm saying? There's never ever an instinct where carbon fiber doesn't look better than all the metal chrome stuff. So carbon fiber replacement on there. But today I'm about to be going back to these, update on the Schwang thing because the event is coming up and we also got some more stuff to do with the V. So no further ado, I could probably sing in the garage right now. I probably sound good. So for the people that didn't see the last video, here goes the CTSV. This bumper had a freaking cone go through it. Well, the last bumper, and it blew all the off of it. So I lost my old carbon lip, but luckily I ended up getting this bumper with the OEM carbon lip. It is a little scuffed, so today we're probably gonna be trying to clean this up. You can see the carbon fiber up here on the grill now. Looks mighty spiffy, ooh, carbon. And then we got the carbon grill right here. Ooh, carbon. And then we got the OEM carbon lip that's just ashy. So hopefully my boy can polish this out, you know what I'm saying? And do a little some some. Also did the carbon fiber mirror caps. Definitely loving that little accent on there. Just some breakup. I'm um, probably gonna have my guy Paradox wrap the chrome trim, get this black. And then we did these carbon handles, but they're not really carbon. They're they're hydro dip, so I don't know how I really feel about them. Feels like it's damn near about to fly off. So I might try to look and see if I can find some real carbon door handles. Cause I ain't feeling the hydro dip. You can tell the difference between that and the real carbon. And it just like it looks good with the dark handles, but I'm just like, yeah. And then also, this thing's gonna be leaving this weekend. Finally, 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 finally leaving this weekend. Gonna be up out of here. So uh yeah. Also, uh Bethel's supposed to be coming to pick up the truck today. Truck's gonna be going back to Bethel. When I was driving it the other day, I was trying to get some brake in miles on it. The rear end started kind of making a little little humming sound. So I uh, called him, told him like what was going on. He was just like, oh, uh, the pattern probably came a little loose. So him and his brother are gonna be driving out here to pick it up. So shout out to my guy Bethel, man. Shout out to Bethel Performance. That's why I fucking fuck with them. Feel me? No questions asked, wasn't no hassle, nothing. It was like, oh, we built the rear end. Let's make a little ho uh, hollering sound. Already ordered the bearings and everything, you know what I'm saying? To get this thing uh, checked out. That way it's no downtime because we are supposed to be hitting the dyno with this thing. But Betho decided, uh, I was gonna drive it to him. He was just like, ah, oh, don't drive it. Me and my brother will come pick it up. So that's what I'm talking about, man. People like that, that stand behind builds, like to a T, are the peoples we love around here, man. So shout out to Betho and his brother and everybody, you know what I'm saying? Thank y'all, thank y'all. But with that being said, let's jump in the V and get up out of here. We got my pink head ass sister over here. Came through to help help the BM clean up. I like it when she comes by, cause then she can do my baby hair and get her looking presentable and all cute. Look at you, you so cute. Look at the camera, look, you so cute. You so cute. Don't try to run from me. Oh, you wanna kiss? That's what you came for? Mm. Look, oh, you wanna kiss this? Mm. Mm. loves you. <laughs> Daddy sweep you off your feet. Daddy sweep you off your feet. <laughs> yeah, I love you too. Why you got all these crumbs and stuff on your mouth? Ew, get off me. Y'all gonna get food? Yeah. Bye, baby. Love you. 
Say bye. Girls. All right, man, we here, my guy Fats, getting ready to color match that emblem. So what we'll be thinking about doing is we're gonna try to just smoke it. We ain't gonna black it out completely. We're just gonna add some clear coat with some black tint to it to try to darken it up a little bit. We're thinking about pulling these off and doing the same thing, but I don't feel like uh, pulling those off right now. So I'm gonna just leave those on there and we're gonna leave the, the back one on there too. I don't feel like debadging all this. This is double side. I'm pretty sure this is probably double side. Nobody got time for that. Honestly, I'm just being lazy. And then once he's done with that and he gets the emblem on, I'm gonna have my man's details this thing for me. Get it all cleaned up. And hopefully we can save this lip. Y'all can see right there, a couple little imperfections scuffed up right there, so hopefully a little wet sand and a buff will get that out this is boost but again i have a brand new lip but i just didn't feel like swapping it on right now because this front bumper has to come back off i got two new fender liners and all the ducting underneath so yeah it doesn't make sense to do it all right now when it's gonna be coming back apart All right, last look at this little emblem. Maybe if this does come out good, I'll go ahead and pull the other emblems off. I just don't want super contrast on the front end. But last little look at this thing, and then we'll see how this smoke look comes out. Make sure your substrate is very clean, object or whatever you're doing, very, very nice, you know? Jay showed me this trick. <laughs> this is Jay's daddy right here. Very clean like that. I have to give it a second, don't spread right yet. Just not yet. Not yet, right now, right yet. Right now. Is it dry? Yeah. I just do one pass like this. Whoosh, 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 whoosh. I turned your, your tip. Oh, what you doing? I got this. Oh, okay, hold on. Let's get this on camera. I'm gonna work it. Alright, move up a little bit. There you go. Come on this side. Okay, okay. And now if it bubbles, you see why. He ain't gonna bubble. I got this. Adhesion promoter. Alright, so I'll we'll wait for the paint to dry. My guy is about to clean this thing up. Boy, look at them wheels. Them wheels look bronze on this thing. Tragic. I can literally drive around a corner and the wheels get hella brake dust on them. It's horrible. Come right off though. Maybe it had an old ceramic coating on it. You got a little right there. I know, I'm gonna have Black Aaron uh, fix the wheels for me. Junior's probably out here macking oh. on potholes. Bah, bah. I mean, it is coming off, but it's still on there, though. That's that mm, that's that <laughs> no lie. I'd be forgetting how clean these wheels are when they're actually clean. We over here doing chrome deletes and shit. Now that he didn't clean the other side, I'm like, hey, 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 be easy on my chrome accents. We need those. Bronze. I gotta find some brake pads that don't kick up this much brake dust, man. This is insane. Then you go look at the other side. Boy, brand new. Honestly forgot these shits were gray. These are like a brush gray finish on here. Always be thinking these motherfuckers is black. Here go the old wheels off the Cummins. Hey, let's go check this little emblem out. Also, we decided not to do the smoke. We just went on ahead and did all black. Oh, I lost it. 
tow trucks. Jesus Christ. You gotta jump on that roof? You jumping on the roof too? Light bar. Huh? Light bar, maybe the turbo. I wanna see your ass climb up there on that roof. Bro, is that a bully? <laughs> Bruh. That nigga got a bully up there. That's hella funny. Damn, y'all went all the way down the side. That's, uh, uh, what's the name? Ha! Bro, I got a bully. It's Kimbo. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> You're thinking of Nam. All right, man. Eight hours later. Uh, and then they get... camera, bro, you would have been like, they got eight hours, and guess what? All we were trying to do was find out what? Fucking find a fuse. Mm -hmm. Bruh. Fuck this truck. Hey, at least you know if you buy a Mac, bro, I'm kind of certified. <laughs> Mac certified now. He's a fuse finder. No, I found the fuse, but he can take everything apart and put it back together. <laughs> All right, come on, Ali, let's see it. Let's see it. Pull that thing up. Let's go, bike life, Ali. I want to see at least eight pedals out this wheelie. Let's go. Pull that thing up. Pull that thing up. Trash. Man, go show how it's done. I want to see you wooly the whole parking lot. Yeah, I'm right now. He can't do it, huh? The whole lot. I can do the whole lot. Can he do it? About, he about like 10 tries. From, from that gate all the way down. Yeah. Do it right now. I might be able to do it. What mean practice run? It's your bike. You should be fresh out the garage, ready to pull that thing up. He ain't doing gate to gate. Oh, is he gonna do it? Nope, nope. That ain't even gate to door. That's cocaine. Why? <laughs> the finisher of Ornhub. <sighs> Wow. What? What was that? We heard pull out. Huh? Who pulls out? <laughs> Nobody over here pulls out. <laughs> Dang, pregnant? Pull out game weak. Do better. Nah. <laughs> Me talking with one on the way. Yeah. Pull out game trash also. Uh, All right, there we go. Mother, the hidden. That clean. Clean, clean. Jeez. God, look at it cleaned all up. Mm. I love this car. It's probably like one of my favorite cars that I bought. Like, I see why Junior had three of these things. Like, they are amazing. I'm honestly so tempted to. Yeah. Buy a second one. <laughs> Have a built one and a stock one. Oh, well, let's not let's not say stock. Less bolt on one, and then we can have this one as the, the wild one. But man, I, I absolutely love this thing. Even though I don't like the black wing as much as I like the V3, just because I love the body lines of the V3 over the smoothness of the black wing. But seeing how amazing this car feels stock, I know the black wing probably feels. Probably even better than this, so I'm uh, almost want to get one. I ain't gonna lie, I almost want to get a black wing. But keep telling myself the next car I get is gonna be either an MK4 Supra or a GT500. But uh, these V's are so amazing, man. Now look, I'm getting special treatment today. I don't even think he did this for the C5. I don't think I don't, I don't think he did this. <laughs> Everyone. Gets Shut up. Let me let me yeah, see he didn't get it. Let me I feel special. What? Fuck you did a whole rap job and I didn't get a fucking wash. That's Cause you don't rap. That sucks. <laughs> Next time you come through, say you wanna walk. 
Tell, tell him next time he gets some paint, you know, you'll wash it. Oh, I got a pain. That's oh. right, you've got pain. You know, he a painter at heart. Yeah, this wrap thing is new for him. I'm sorry. It's new. Damn, we got the last little, little touch that need to go on. Oh, awesome. I gotta go somewhere and get some pictures of this thing that's clean. Looking too clean right now. All right, man, y'all can see this beautiful scenery back here. Woo! So I decided to stop right here real quick. I wanted to get a couple flicks, you know, some content or something to post up on the gram. But yeah, man, this is a beautiful view. The V is looking good, fresh and clean. God, and this is cover photo worthy. Sheesh. But yeah, all cleaned up, man. Finally, it's kind of like where I wanted at. Only thing I might change is the wheels. I don't know if I want to downsize to 19s for the power that we're going to be having. I also don't know what style of wheel I want to do. And I'm not sure on if I want to do white faces with polished lips or if I want to do bronze faces with polished lips on the white. So uh, I don't know. I love these wheels, but I do want to have an extra set just, you know, for, for something a little bit more sticky that's going to hold traction. Yeah, God, this is this is a beautiful view. This looks good on camera too. I might be able to steal some still grabs off this because I think this is picking up the lighting and everything phenomenally. But yeah, man, this is gonna be it. We're gonna wrap this up. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. Uh, soon, 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 we're about to be getting into some crazy V content. Um, I'm looking forward to it, man. Soon, we're about to have action. I know y'all are seeing a lot of the build stuff and kind of more of updates. But soon we're really about to be cracking on these builds, waiting for the LS7 parts to come for the C, uh, C5. And then we're still waiting for the Magnuson setup to come for Magnuson for the V. And then we just got a lot of other stuff coming up, man. I promise y'all. So hopefully you guys enjoyed, man. Thank y'all for watching and rocking with me all this time, man. A lot of y'all have been here for years. I greatly appreciate it, man. I love y'all to death for it. I uh, always say that, you know, here and there, but I really hope you guys really understand that I really do appreciate all the fucking love and support y'all be showing, man. Literally, as I'm sitting here in the middle of nowhere on this dark road, a car drives by, he stops right there and was like, is that Mike, Mike? Turns around, was chopping it up with them, man. So the love is real, bro. The love is real. Um, I just want to say thank y'all, man. Thank y'all, appreciate it. Um, and yeah, let's just uh, wrap it up and call it a night. We out. <laughs> I've been going too crazy, these niggas too shady